Hi guys, welcome back for another speed racing video. If you like what you see, make sure you subscribe and share this channel with your friends. Today's video, it's all about naturally red colored animal speed races. And includes the following animals, red crown crane, red deer, red fox, red kangaroo, red panda, and the red rough lemur. Let the race begin. The plumage of red crown cranes is white, with black tail feathers, neck and face, as well as a row of black feathers on the wings. They are named for the distinctive patch of bare, red skin on the top of their head. Red crown cranes stand 5 feet to 5.2 foot tall and can have a wingspan of 7.3 feet up to 8.3 feet. They weigh between 10.6 pounds and 23.1 pounds. Males tend to be heavier than females, but sexes are otherwise alike. Red deer are not endangered and are a species of least concern. There are even invasive populations that have been intentionally released as game animals in New Zealand, Australia, and South America. The red deer is both hunted and commercially farmed for its meat, fur, and antlers. Red foxes are not endangered and their populations are stable. In Australia, red foxes are an invasive species that have been introduced for fox hunting, a tradition originating and spread from the United Kingdom. Traditional fox hunts for sport are a controversial subject in modern times and banned in many countries, however, foxes are still hunted and kept as a source of furs. They are widely regarded as pests due to them preying on livestock such as poultry or sheep. kangaroo is prolific in Australia so it is not necessary to have efforts in place to preserve the species. Sometimes kangaroos are culled to control the population, and they are often killed for meat and leather. However, hunting and killing of kangaroos is strictly controlled, those who want to shoot kangaroos must have a license and there is a limit to how many kangaroos can be killed each year to make sure a healthy population size is maintained.
The species is endangered, primarily due to deforestation that is causing habitat loss. However, they are also poached for their fur and are vulnerable to inbreeding. Inbreeding depression is caused when the number of animals in the population vastly decreases, meaning the genetic pool is limited and animals are more likely to mate with their relatives resulting in weak offspring. To conserve populations in the wild, many protected areas have been established around their territories and, in some areas, locals have launched ecotourism startups to encourage people to visit and see the red pandas, raising awareness and money for conservation efforts. The red rough lemur, or Varicia rubra, is a critically endangered species of primate native to the northern Masola rainforests of Madagascar. With yellow eyes and a black pointed face surrounded by the distinctive red ruff, the lemur's body is covered in thick red fur and it has a black tail, hands, and feet. It also has a white patch on the top of its head. The species is threatened by habitat loss and hunting, they are particularly vulnerable to this because they require well-established forests with tall trees to survive and forage for fruit, nectar and flowers. Therefore it cannot live in young or newly planted forests. They are also frequently hunted for bush meat. To combat these problems, the Masoala Rainforest is a protected national park, but illegal logging and hunting still takes place.
and today's winner is the red deer. The heaviest red deer ever recorded weighed 497 kilograms. Male red deer make a loud roar known as a bugle to aid in the cohesion of their harem and to signal to rival males. The red deer's hooves are soft at birth, so fawns rarely walk for the first 16 days of their lives until they harden. Red deer fawns are born with spots for camouflage, but lose their spots by the time they are 5 months old. Red deer shed and regrow their antlers every year, while they are growing, they are covered in velvet which provides blood and nutrients to the growing bones. Thanks for watching.